Hey, what's up everybody? This is Chicken Possible with Rewards Hunter back with another Achievement of the Week guide. So today we're going to be doing a quick and easy achievement in the game Goat Simulator Remastered, which has just been added to Game Pass recently and is currently one of the most popular games on Game Pass. Everybody checking out the new version of this game. So there's been a version of this game just called Goat Simulator. You may have seen it, you may have played it before. It's been on Game Pass for quite a while. It's an older game, but they've they've got this remastered version that's just come out with some new levels added into it and lots of new features. So we're gonna grab an achievement in that game called Valkyrie. Um, this one is available on the cloud, so if you wanna play it that way, you can. I'll be playing the downloaded version as usual. And as always, this will help you with your daily quest for earning an achievement in a Game Pass game. And if you're working on any of the weeklies or monthlies for November, then it'll help for those as well and get you one step closer to finishing those up. If you do play the downloaded version, then you could get these 10 points for playing a game installed on your console for 15 minutes, and that will get you one step closer to finishing up your weekly console bonus as well. So that is what I'm gonna be doing here, and we'll go ahead and get started in Goat Simulator Remastered. So this one should only take us about five minutes to finish at most. From the main menu, you wanna make sure that you select the level that's called Goat Simulator Goat City Bay. It's the one with the little pink logo underneath. So select that, and then it should look like this. It'll have the little Ferris wheel in the background, and press A to get started and play that level. So, like I said, the name of this achievement is Valkyrie. So we are going to start out playing as the goat. This is a very quirky, kind of fun physics simulator game. So if you've never played any of the goat simulators before, you'll get a feel for it from this video. But what we're gonna do is we're gonna take our goat and we're gonna follow the roadway right here. And we are going to go get ourselves a rider. We're gonna go get a person that will ride on the back of the goat. So let's take a left, and we're actually gonna go over to that park, which is over to my right. You can start to see it a little bit. This is where the Ferris wheel is and the roller coaster and everything. We're gonna take another right here, and we're gonna go across one of the bridges to get over here. You could also just jump across the water, but make your way over here however you want to. And we are going to look for the bull riding ring, which has these little inflatable sort of orangish brown barriers around the outside. So jump inside of that. And then we can use the headbutt for the goat by pressing the right trigger. So do that and that'll knock the bull out of the way and you should automatically get a rider. For some reason I got a rider and then my rider suddenly glitched and switched to a different person, but they may still be working some of the kinks out of this game. There may still be some bugs that they're they're trying to get fixed. But it, in all honesty, it was always kind of a glitchy game if you if you haven't played it before. It's uh, yeah, it's always like I said, a fun physics simulator. So we're gonna retrace our steps now and go back to the left on this roadway, and then we're going to go to the right here, back up the hill. And what we need to do is take our rider now that we've got him, and launch ourselves with the catapult that's way up here. You might be able to see it at the upper right of the screen there. And we're going to launch ourselves off of the catapult. And when we do that, we'll get the Valkyrie achievement. So we're just gonna take a right at the top of the hill here. You should see the catapult just there and the little bowl of the catapult that has a goat trophy inside of it. So just jump inside of there and this was obviously kind of glitchy for me as well, but whenever the catapult successfully launches you into the air, then you should get the Valkyrie achievement right there. So not too difficult. Just go grab your rider, come back up here to the hill, and launch out of the catapult, and you should be able to grab that one in five minutes or less. So that is pretty much it for today for this Achievement of the Week guide. I've been working over the last few months, as many of you know, on Goat Simulator guides for Tier 3 members. So if you're looking for even more Goat Simulator guides, I've been releasing those for months and months for Tier 3 members on the channel. So if you're interested in finding out more about those guides and how that membership program works, then please click on the join button here in the video to find out more about that program. I'll be back next week with a new Escape Academy guide. We've been working through a bunch of achievements in that game. That is not part of the membership program. That's just available to everybody. So I'll have three more achievements in that series coming out next week, and I'll have a new Achievement of the Week guide in two weeks. So thanks for checking this one out, and I'll look forward to seeing you all in those future guides. Thanks for watching everyone. If you found that video helpful, please be sure to click the subscribe button here on YouTube and hit the bell for notifications. You can also find some helpful links in the description if you want to stay connected.
Stay tuned for more Microsoft rewards and achievement guides, and I'll see you in the next one.